Hey everybody, it's Katie the Hat Lady, ready to sing and get you to sing. And we're gonna sing to the rain and to the moon. And we might even take a little trip to somewhere where it's warm, not so cold as it is here. So I'm gonna start out with um, a song that you guys all know, and it's gonna give you some advice on how to behave in the next coming you know, winter days. And so I want you to sit up straight, take a nice deep breath in, right? Move your hands up like this. Oh yeah, we're gonna stretch a little bit, okay? And this is about uh, buttoning up your overcoat. You ready? And a one, and a two, and a three. Button up your overcoat when the wind blows free. Take good care of yourself. You belong to me. Eat an apple every day. Get to bed by three. Take good care of yourself. You belong to me. Be careful crossing streets. Ooh, ooh. Don't eat too much meat. Ooh, ooh. Don't eat too many sweets. Ooh, ooh. You'll get a pain and ruin your tum-tum. Stay away from bootleg hooch. Oh, oh. When you're on a spree. Take good care of yourself. You belong to me. All right. Hope that warmed you up. I'm starting to get warm, too. And getting ready to sing some more. Now, you know, we got a full moon tomorrow. I don't know. By the time you see this um, video, it might have still... Well, you know, it's full full for a couple of days. So, of course, I have to sing to the moon. Hmm. Because I think the moon has a lot of pull on um, well, artists and singers and all kinds of people. You know, I worked in a psych hospital and um, for a little while, and I asked all the nurses there, does the full moon make people extra, um, you know, silly and strange and crazy? And they all said, oh yeah, it does. So anyway, we're gonna sing a song about the moon and it's making us silly and it's making us sing and want to eat pizza because when the and fall in love okay that's it and fall in love here we go so you guys sit up straight take that nice big deep breath in exhale and then you move your hands like this okay and we're going to sing about the, the moon and your eye and the pizza pie goes like this. When the moon hits your eye like a big pizza pie, that's amore. When you're walking the street and your feet, they don't meet, you're in love. When your heart seems to shine like you had too much wine, oh, signore, pardon me, but you see back in old Napoli, that's amore. When the stars make you drool just like pasta fazoo. That's amore. When your heart seems to sing, tick tick ding, tick tick ding, you're in love. When your heart seems to shine like you had too much wine. Oh, signore, pardon me, but you see back in old Napoli, everybody sing, that's amore. Pasta Bazoo and love. All right, you guys, that's a great one about the moon. And they say it does influence people. So we have to, um, you know, a couple of wise men there at Alzheimer's Service East Bay said, well, you know, what it really affects is dogs. Oh, yeah, it does. It affects dogs and it makes them howl, do kind of wild things. And so we're going to do... A song. Wait a second. Where's my Where's my dog wig? Oh, here we go. I'm gonna be a poodle, a pink poodle. Okay, hang on. I have to change to be a pink poodle. Look, see, I've got my pink poodle right here. Okay, here we go. See, it's my poodle dog wig. <laughs> I can barely see out of this thing. Well, I don't know how dogs do it. They have to see out a lot more here than this. So this song is about a man, actually it could be a woman, 
who is so tired of paying taxes and bad driving and, well, you know, all kinds of things that you have to do as a human being. Um, COVID, you know, all getting a vaccine. They just want to be a dog. All right. So you guys have heard this before because one of my favorite songs about when you get sick of being a human being, you might want to be a dog. So you guys can all sing it. Okay. Sit up straight. Take a nice deep breath in. Roll those shoulders. Yeah. Roll them. And we're going to say, oh. And the count of three, we're going to put it together with me. Katie the Hat Lady, and sing about being a dog, and a one, and a two, and a three. Oh, I want to be a dog. I want to wag my tail. Chase cars, rock over garbage cans, and bite the lady who brings me the mail. Oh, I want to be a dog. I want to be around. Being human these days, way too crazy. I just want to be a hound. Oh, I want to have dog breath. I want to learn to growl. Scratch fleas and ticks. Run after sticks. This is your turn, folks. The moon's going to make me howl. Arr! Oh, I want to be a dog. I want to be around. Being human these days is way too crazy. I just want to be a hound. Everybody howl with me. Thank you very much. Oh, this wig is something else. I love it, though. Ah, but it's kind of itchy, so I'm going to change into another hat. Now, this hat... It's much more manageable. And this is a song, another song about the moon. This song was sung by uh, Fats Domino, good old Fats Domino from New Orleans. And he sang about, you know, the moon st staying still, you know, and all those romantic things that happen. So I want you guys to sing along. I found my thrill on Blueberry Hill, on Blueberry Hill, when I found you, the moon stood still on Blueberry Hill. And lingered until my dreams came true. The wind in the willow sang love's sweet melodies. But all of those vows we made were never to be. Though we're apart, you're part of me still. For you were my thrill on Blueberry Hill. Oh, yeah. All right. That's when the moon stood still and you knew you are having fun. Well, I found this old chestnut, very cool song. <clears throat> and this is about not just any old moon, but that old devil moon. I look at you, suddenly something in your eyes I see soon begins bewitching me. It's that old devil moon that you stole from the skies. It's that old devil moon in your eyes. You and your glance make this romance too hot to handle. Stars in the night blazing their light can't hold a candle to your razzle-dazzle. You got me flying high and wide on a magic carpet ride full of butterflies inside. Want to cry, want to croon, want to laugh like a loon. It's that old devil moon in your eyes. Just when I think 
I'm free as a dove, old devil moon, deep in your eyes, binds me with love. It's that old devil moon that you stole from the skies. It's that old devil moon in your eyes. Oh, yeah. Oh, I love that song. Count Basie. Yeah, that is such a good one. Well, you know, there's lots of moon songs, but I want to sing a couple songs for the wind and the rain, because, boy, have we been having a lot of that. I have to change into another hat. This is a Western song, so got me half a Western hat. And uh, this is about that wind out there in the West. That's where we are. And they call that wind, what do they call it? Fritz? Nope. Pearl? Nope. Mariah. So it goes like this. And you guys, oh, I'm going to teach you a chorus, so you please sing along. It goes like this. Mariah, Mariah, they call the wind Mariah, way out west. They have a name for rain and wind and fire. The fire is Pete, the rain is Joe, and they call the wind Mariah, Mariah. Here it comes, Mariah. They call the wind Mariah. Before I heard Mariah's name and heard her wail and whining, I had a gal and she had me and the sun was always shining. But then one day I left that gal, I left her far behind me. And now I'm lost, so doggone lost, not even God can find me. Everybody sing, Mariah, Mariah, they call the wind Mariah. All right. Thanks, folks. That was a good old uh, Western song about that wind, and boy, it does, it does blow pretty hard out here. And... If you're ever in the uh, desert in California, especially around this time into the spring, boy, oh boy, you can really experience that. I did that once. I was um, there with my family, and um, we also brought a friend with us, a young, he was a bachelor, but he was a teacher and really nice guy, and he came out with us, he followed us, and we were at this place, I think it was called Red Rock Canyon in Southern California in the desert. And we were having a great time and just exploring the caves around there and taking lovely walks. And, you know, it'd be kind of cold in the morning sometimes, but it then it kind of get nice. And then one night um, when we were there, like, oh, actually with day we were there, we came back and our the wind had come up and it had picked up our tent and moved our little tent and it was sitting in a puddle. And I was thinking, well, that's it. I think we're going to go to a motel now. But my husband and our friend George were so determined not to go to a hotel. They loved the wide open spaces that we, um, they took the, um, the little tent. And first they made a big fire, right? And they sat there and dried that tent <laughs> next to the fire, making sure they didn't burn it. Right, turning it around, and sure enough, it dried. So I guess we were going to stay there that night. Well, it was quite a night because um, the wind had sort of died down. But then what happened is we had just, oh, I know what I'd done. I had said, I would said to my husband, I don't know. I don't have a good feeling about this, Jack. I think that wind's going to come back up. And he goes, oh, come on, Katie, just one more night um, camping. And then we'll go to a motel or something. And, I, and he said, well, you know, there's this place right a couple miles down. They sell Rick homemade sausages. And those are going to taste really good on the campfire, you know. And so I thought, well, you know, that's how you always get me to do something. You find some good food. And anyway, and so 
we got some good sausages and we roasted them and had some other stuff and and it was beautiful and great dinner. And then all of a sudden, like that, from who knows, the West, there was this wind. Ooh, 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 like that. And it was so windy that it was blowing the sand, because we're in the desert, right? Right into our eyes. And so we had no choice but to go into our tent and seal up the tent, right? And you know, try to try to sleep, even though it was like only seven, seven thirty at night. Anyway, and so the kid, the my daughter who was ten at the time, she and her girlfriend, who we'd brought, um, they had their own little tent, and then my husband and my our son, who was about four at the time, he was in our tent, and then our friend had a little tiny tent that they used for mountain. You know, they're like one of those little pup tents, but they're real flat. He's the only one who had a decent tent. And sure enough, in the next five, ten minutes, there was this, another sound. Arr! Arr! And sure enough, that wind came and it took that tent, our tent, right down. It took it down to the ground. And I said, well, Jack, you wanted to stay. I guess you better fix it. And so he goes out and, boy, I peeked out see what he was doing, make sure he didn't hurt himself. And he had the, you know, the tents, ropes, and it was literally buffeting him against the wind. The wind was like, take it, he's like this, uh, you know, trying to pull the, the ropes tight enough. And there just happened to be a, con a picnic table there with some concrete. And so he could tie it to the metal of the picnic table, right? So he managed, he's really Mr. Fix-It, to get that tent up straight again. And we go, he goes back to bed and to sleeping bag. And sure enough, about five minutes later, oh, oh, here comes the tent, boom, down. And the tent was like mm, two inches off our faces. And it's amazing, my son slept through this whole thing. Now my daughter and her um, girlfriend, their tent, while this wind was blowing around, had blown completely down. And so I told her, Josie, you and Jeanette go in the van and sleep in the van. Take your sleeping bags. So that's what they did. And they were in the van. But then I looked out the window or like looked out the tent that was <laughs> barely standing. And I saw that the van was moving like that. I got really nervous. Like maybe they'd get knocked over in the van. And so I said, to my husband, I said, let's, let's go to a motel now. George is doing fine in his little tent, but we can just go to um, a motel nearby, about 10 miles away. And he goes, I don't, uh-uh. I said, why? I goes, I'm afraid we'd get blown off the road. Ah! So we, I stayed there the whole time listening to the wind. Ah! Ah! And I barely slept a wink till about four in the morning and it was the weirdest thing. The wind just stopped, total quiet. And we'd sleep for another three hours. And the next day I woke up, I said, okay, next time I think we're gonna mot motel, we better go to a motel, okay. So that was when I called the wind Mariah, Woo! like that. But we gotta sing for this all this rain too. So I gotta change hats. In fact, not just sing folks, we're gonna dance. Okay. All right. So this is about that pennies from heaven. So sing along and dance along if you can. In fact, we're going to go like this every time we say pennies from heaven. Because that's that rain. Okay. And a one and a two and a three. Every time it rains, it rains pennies from heaven. Don't you know each cloud contains pennies from heaven? You'll find your fortunes falling all over town. Make sure that your umbrella is upside down. Save it for a basket of sunshine and flowers. If you want the things you love, you must have showers. So if you hear it thundering, don't run under a tree. There'll be pennies from heaven for you and me.
Oh, yeah. That's that very old chestnut. I like it a lot. Okay. But we have to do that one for Miss um, Billy Holiday. I have to change hats. A Billy Holiday hat. I bet she'd wear this. Okay. So this is about that stormy weather, folks. All right. And, you know, it'll be getting through it, but we got to sing about it and respect that stormy weather. All right. Don't know why there's no sun up in the sky. Stormy weather. Since my man and I ain't together. Keeps raining all the time, all the time. Can't go on, everything I had is gone. Stormy weather, just can't get my poor self together. Keeps raining all the time. Since he went away, home blues walked in and met me. If he stays away, own rock and share will get me. All I do is pray the Lord above will let me walk in the sun once more. Can't go on, everything I had is gone. Stormy weather, just can't get my poor self together. Keeps raining all the time. Keeps raining all the time. Oh, yeah. Oh, Billie Holiday. Gotta love that woman. Well, listen, we gotta do a funner one. Well, this is about what you do when the raindrops keep falling on your head, okay? So, I'm gonna change hats. It's also kind of a country type song. All right. So when it happens, in fact, I was walking today and the raindrops were falling on my head. And I was thinking of this song it goes like this. Raindrops keep falling on my head. And just like the man whose feet are too big for his bed, nothing seems to fit. Those raindrops keep falling on my head. They keep falling. So I just... Did me some talking to the sun. And I said I didn't like the way he got things done. Cheating on the job. Those raindrops keep falling on my head. They keep falling. But there's one thing I know. Those blues they send to meet me won't defeat me. It won't be long till happiness steps up to greet me. Ooh, raindrops keep falling on my head. But that doesn't mean my eyes will soon be turning red. Crying's not for me. No, I'm never going to stop the rain by complaining because I'm free. Nothing's worrying me. Da 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 It won't be long till happiness steps up to greet me. Ooh, ooh. That's right. So if those raindrops keep falling on your head, well, you know what to do. All right. Well, or you could just get on a plane or a boat and, you know, go to a warmer place, right? Where the rain isn't so cold as here. That's a place called Jamaica. All right. And so I have to sing you a cute little song about going to Jamaica. Mm -hmm. Hang on, it's right here. Thus I have to drink some tea or some water. <clears throat> and I wanna remind you, just cause it's wet outside, you know, you gotta drink that water, not just walk in it, okay? Cause it's very good for you. Okay, this is a guy, but about a guy, I guess he's getting tired of you know, the cold rain and snow. 
and he decides to go down to the Caribbean on a boat. This is a lot warmer down there, right? This goes like this. We sailed on the sloop John B., my grandfather and me. Round to Nassau town we didn't roam. Drinking all night, got into a fight, oh yeah. Well, I feel so break up, I want to go home. So hoist up the John B. sails, see how the mainsail sets. Call for the captain ashore, let me go home, let me go home, I want to go home. Please let me go home. Oh, yeah, this is the worst trip I've ever been on. Well, the first mate, he got drunk, broke up the people's trunk. Constable had to come and take him away, take him away, Sheriff John Stone. Please leave me alone. Oh, yeah, I feel so break up. I want to go home. So hoist up the John B. sails. See how the mainsail sets. Call for the captain ashore. And let me go home. Let me go home. I want to go home. Please let me go home. Oh, yeah. This is the worst trip I've ever been on. Oh, wow. That's a bad way to go down to Jamaica. I had, you know, a lot more fun when I went. I didn't go on a boat. I went on an airplane. And, oh, my gosh, it was so fun down there. And it was in January. It was right around now. Oh, my gosh, the beaches were perfect. And I'm telling you, I sang this song when I left. It, I was so sad in some ways. I would just, you know, be ready to be a beach bum. So go, this is a song about a guy who goes down there, and he almost doesn't come back. Goes like this. Down the way where the nights are gay and the sun shines daily on the mountain top. I took a trip on a sailing ship and when I reached Jamaica, I made a stop at home. Sad to say I'm on my way. Won't be back for many a day. My heart is down, my head is turning around. I had to leave a little girl in Kingston town. Sounds of laughter everywhere and the dancing girls sway to and fro. I must declare my heart is there though I've been from Maine to Mexico. But I'm sad to say I'm on my way. Won't be back for many a day. My heart is down, my head is turning around. I had to leave a little girl in Kingston town. Down at the market, you can hear ladies cry out while on their heads they wear. Akira is salt fish on nice and the rum is fine at the time of year. But I'm sad to say I'm on my way. Won't be back for many a day. My heart is down, my head is turning around. I had to leave a little girl in Kingston town. Leave a little girl Kingston Town. All right. Yeah, that's when I went down there. That was fun. All right. So, um, folks, I'm going to round it up, you know, get all get it all together here. But I'm going to give you your homework assignments, okay? I'm a Berkeley Adult School teacher, and I give very hard homework. So here it goes. Um, drink some water and be nice to your friends there. And your family, of course, and the staff, because they work so hard there. And also, don't forget to sing and dance, all right? Don't forget it. All right, and we're going to pack it up just like this. Pack up all my cares and woes. Here I go, singing low. Bye, bye, blackbird. Where somebody waits for me and sugar sweet. So is she. Bye, bye, blackbird. 
No one here could love or understand me. Oh, what hard luck stories they all had me. Make my bed and light the light. I'll be home late tonight. Blackbird, my boy. Blackbird, my boy. Bye, everybody. See you next week.